So a quick update on the roof. I um, One thing I did do yesterday was I cut two by sixes to go across the sawhorses so I have a better bench. It just is a little bit nicer. I was even going to connect them, but then I thought I don't really need to. So for now, I'm use it this way, but it makes a nice surface to work on. So this morning I did build a post and that's in. So we now have four posts in and I'm, it's easier to build them up out here where I have better lighting and then carry the post down. And last night I did a little bit of concrete work around the stove area. So that's looking a little bit better. So back to the main project right now. The roof extension. So the first one took a lot of time. Just getting those angles right. Getting this lined up. So it's nice and even. Straight. And I'm happy with it. I think that's got to go over just a touch. And square it off. With the top. So we're going two without the support. Then a support two more than a support now it's not necessarily going to even up in the center there or maybe i should make it even up i'm not sure i I'm, instead of going 16 inch on center maybe i'll alternate it so i can get the support about the same distance from the side so that's what i'm about to do right now is go up and measure them i have a bunch cut ahead i have all four supports so we'll have one in, in this area and then one over there. And then when we get to the side here, then we gotta figure out what we're doing there. But let's at least get there one thing at a time. And this should help protect these doors, which I really like the way it is. Sure, if you're parking your car in here, you wouldn't be able to do it fast enough. But I'm not doing that, so. Get our measurements and put the next few up.